Thank you. 
these moments are important, which you feel like you deserve, if you trust yourself, because it establishes your ability to set dreams and goals. Retrograde periods are one of the most healing periods that we have, because it allows us some time to just go inside and do the work there.
support than you think. 
this opportunity. 
something. It doesn't have to do anything except support you. So whatever you need, take. And what you don't, baby, just let it go. Really. Don't even worry about it. What's for you, baby? It's for you. And so I want you to go where love loves you back. So we're going to work today on channeling that energy so that you can be aware and you can be receptive to that because sometimes it's hard to see. And it might be in certain areas of life too. Um, and then I always like to do like little life, life lessons too. But let's jump on it. Also, if you really like my vibe and would like additional support, and again, sometimes it's mystical, sometimes it's just self-care, sometimes it's mindfulness, head on over to the Patreon community where we are this this inner circle of collectiveness. Um, and so that is support there too. So let's go ahead and get started with the prayer. I'm still reading it because it's still new. And yeah, so because consent matters, do I have your permission to say a prayer? Okay, may I touch you? Okay. Just an inhale and an exhale. Just letting some stuff go. Okay, you ready? Okay. Dear Mother, Father, God, and all for the highest vibrational good only, please connect us to the highest intentions and validate information from our highest self only. Please release what we need to let go and embrace what allows us to grow. Let our journey encompass the lineages, traditions, religions, and spiritual paths that bring light out through us to share with others. I say all of this in the name of I am. Ashe, Ashe, Ashe. I'm really starting to love that. Okay. So, relaxed in this moment with yourself. Just allowing this kind of cool energy to just, just flow over you, okay? And just bringing it down, bringing it down, bringing it down. Because I want you to be in a calm state. Because I don't want any resistance as you go in and do that inner work. So today we work together, but it's up to you. I mean, you are the magic uh, of consistency and break whatever cycle you might be in, okay? So, as we are working here, and we are going inside, what I want you to do is just have a memory of something that brings a smile to you, or it could just be something that you like. Bringing that in, and exhaling. Having that moment. you go 
really valuable pays you what you're worth that works too maybe you have impact in a very collaborative space you know all of that stuff you just want to know that you are being valued that what you're doing matters and all of that stuff okay
these moments to find creative outlets in order to kind of funnel that energy into it. If it you feel like you're being fed, like fed the energy that you need to like do whatever you need to do, that's like um, superpowers right there. You better run with that. Run with that. And if you're feeling a little down, you're feeling like a, you know, another thing about cancer energy is um, the food. So be mindful of your food, whether that is you need some comfort food or you need to be eating things that maybe uh, will regulate your internal mechanisms a little bit better, okay? So back into this space. And I just want to send some words of encouragement out there. We have a lot of interesting things happening from an astrological perspective, but just pretty much the interpretation of them is a lot of change. We have a lot of Uranus energy. And you know, Uranus, which is the modern ruler of Aquarius, shock and awe, revolution, quick change. Change that doesn't really uh, consider the emotions, more of like, we gotta get this shit done type change. So, if you are experiencing sudden change, sudden energy, some new shit, you know, some old shit you thought that was like gone, be sweet to yourself, be patient with yourself, be in this space and be in this moment with yourself because it's gonna be okay, you're gonna figure it out, everything is figure outable. and whenever these difficult moments come up, it's pretty much an opportunity to evaluate you know, either past lessons learn or what actions you need to take in your life. And sometimes when you need to move past somewhere, it's like a big kind of thing. Um, uh, I want to say arduous endeavor, but I want to like also say kind of like it's just like big. It's like, ugh, how do you get there? Um, but at the end of the day, Everything is faith and trust, whether that is you believe in, you know, something higher or whether you just, or more importantly, have a relationship with yourself, which is that faith and in trust within yourself that, you know, if you are being led in a direction, uh, it doesn't analytically, uh, mentally have to make sense. It doesn't emotionally have to make sense. Just if there's this sense of knowing in a direction in your life pulling you somewhere and it's going to be a whisper. Usually it's like a tap on the shoulder. It's like a right? And if you have life happening, you're like, you don't be paying attention to that shit. Listen to it because it's going to take you to peace. It's going to take you to calm. It's going to take you to clarity. You know, I talked about this in um, <laughs> Go Where Love Loves You Back because I was saying that like when I made the leap and I left where I was before, it it almost can be like addictive to be in the ups and the downs of like kind of these environments that are like um, but I also, I was positioned in a really good way in which I could leave where I was and um, explore, you know, other uh, things and not worry about it financially. And I realized that with that happening, it's like I had to have a whole entire change in mentality. A mentality that honestly, maybe six months or a year prior to that, I didn't even have or I didn't have the ability to do that. So if you had told me six um, or even a year prior to that, I could make moves like that. I'd be like, no, that's too much. But y'all, this is Go Get It July, where we are bringing our goals together and we're going after them. Um, in the Patreon community, there's going to be additional supplemental uh, support uh, in Energy Healing Circle as well, where we all come together and we channel for the collective good and all that stuff. Um, but for that theme, it's basically saying that you can get to wherever it is you want to go. Uh, the first time uh, we ever did something like this was last November, a nonstop November, and I just heard such positive energy from people, and even to this day, people are reaching out to me like, hey, you know, nonstop November, I really went all in there, and it just created this environment where people were just saying yes to themselves, and yes to what they want, and yes to going after things, and yes to, you know, getting over challenges and obstacles, and yes to, you know, mental and emotional support, and yes to taking and yes to whatever it is that they needed in that moment. They just were 
sometimes that means like it's just you it's lovely to have a community um and we are a community you and i and all of us we are a community which is also helpful and cool uh but sometimes in your everyday life maybe people aren't on the same wavelength as you maybe you have to kind of do your own thing or maybe you have to give yourself some space give other people some space to be able to grow into whatever it is that they need in that moment but you have to do it but sometimes it's like life is happening things may be out of your control which happens in life but it's because you have to let things go 
looking at me like keep walking and keep walking and keep walking and now like I walk every day um, and I feel like oh I gotta get that out because um, I can really be a homebody sometimes so I'm like okay get out there you know uh, and also to be around the people I love so whenever you know my friends or my family are asking me to do something I'm like yeah 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 whereas before I'd be like oh I should be thinking about this I should be younger. 